Hey guys, this is my game, Terra Similar. My name is Tom Devaney. I'm about to talk about my thought process with this game and maybe show you one of the paths in the game. This is a text based game and there are multiple endings. What you choose in the beginning ultimately branches you off and leads you to multiple endings. And yeah. So starts off with the menu. Welcome to Are You Smarter Than a Donald Trump? And are you smarter than Donald Trump pops up? And of course I am. If not, I wouldn't be able to play. And this is the main game. There's the person there who you will figure out about as you play. You actually already know him though. He is a Muslim. You have captured him and you have him locked up in your basement. And I recommend that you actually play this game before you watch this video so that you got a handle on it but ultimately the thought process with it was that the first option and the second option lead to the same path I mean you it all depends on what you do after the first ones but ultimately zero and one give you on the path and you can eventually branch off and get multiple endings but they're practically the same. Now the third one is different. Um, this one is more of the religious extremist, a, a Christian extremist, sorry. So he's actually a Christian terrorist pretty much. And then there's the fourth option which is the Browski option. He's much more chill and he's pretty whack and he, he says some funny shit but those are the main three choices in the beginning and I just think it's interesting because the first two I'm here to wipe you off the existence off of this planet and I'm not going to let you harm any innocents those you can choose whether or not you want to kill him but for I'm on a God given mission you have to kill him there is no option for you not to kill him and for hey bro I see you regaining consciousness you don't have to kill him I mean you can, you cannot kill him and that just shows the personality of the choice these choices set up your personality for the rest of the game the first two you're going to kill him and the reason is because you think he's a terrorist and you're trying to save lives and you can believe his explanations to you to try his explanations that are trying to say no I'm not a terrorist but you don't have to believe him either and then the I'm on my God given mission one anything he says you could give five blanks about you are a terrorist so you don't listen to logic so you have to kill him because that's the type of person you are and then for the hey bro the broski option you're just kinda chill you're try you're gonna kill him because you think he's dangerous but he gives you evidence and you're like wow that's that's true man good call thank you for fact checking me and you can't kill him cuz that's not the type of person you are you're not you're not a terrorist you just you think what you're doing is good but once you see it's not you don't do it and I, this game was just inspired by the Paris bombings and um, Donald Trump obviously his Islamophobia and I just made a game that was inspired by that and I'm just gonna go through one of these branches just in case you didn't play the game I'll go on the third branch and I'll narrate it uh, what's happening I'm on my God given mission God given what? What the heck are you talking about? Jesus speaks to me. God speaks to me too. What did you just say? My God. Don't act like we have the same God. 
Say God again and I'll end your life right now in Fidel. My God is the only true God. What, what do you want from me? It's not what I want. I am but a mere instrument of something much more powerful than you or me. What does that something want from me? It wants you to burn in hell for believing in a false idol. Please, don't do anything hasty. Oh, I won't do anything hasty. You see, everything, everything I'm going to do has already been planned by my amazing God. So how can that be hasty? You're delusional. Your God doesn't want you to kill people. The Bible preaches peace. Don't act like you know the Bible. Your kind reads the Quran. But let's not get beside ourselves. Yeah, that's better. I love the silence. Please don't kill me. I'm not what your God wants. It's not what your God wants. That's funny, because guess what? God just called me and told me to put you in hell, because the devil is waiting for you. Marco! Uh, so yeah, that's one of my branches. Um, you should try out all the other ones. The fourth branch is quite tasty and quite humorous. Hopefully you like my game and hopefully you see that it isn't Islamophobic, but is actually something a bit deeper. Thank you for watching.